Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is a freebies video. These are the things I got for free between April 16th and 22nd of 2017. Um, I got mostly magazines as usual, but I did get some other neat things. So the first thing I got is actually a two-pack of magazines. On this side it has Better Homes and Gardens. It says Chill Out. So it's like a guide to making your own ice cream. And then at the bottom it says Celebrate Mom and has um, brunch ideas and pretty handmade gifts. And on the other side is Family Circle. I forgot the address card was there. Uh, and it also has Mother's Day ideas and then um, chicken recipes and like meditation, uh, creative spaces, desserts, and some other things. There's also a tiny little, like, magazine in the middle, but I'm not sure what it is. Then this one is Entertainment Weekly, the summer movie preview. It says it's a special double issue. It says exclusive on the set of Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2, New Villains, New Plants, New Dead, and Aw, Baby Group. Scoop on the 110 biggest films, Wonder Woman, Baywatch, Transformers, King Arthur, Pirates of the Caribbean, Alien, Covenant, Atomic Font, and more. I really, really enjoy this magazine. So that's finding out about the new movies coming out. And, like, the interviews they do are good. And they also cover books, like, in the back. So I enjoy that. Uh, I got two issues of Metro Weekly while I was out. Um, they're from the 6th and the 13th. They didn't have the ones that were actually from uh, that week, like that actual week when, I, when these freebies are from. Um, so this one is Congressional Wisdom. It's about a congressman from Wisconsin. And this one is Drawing on Life. It's about a cartoonist named Allison Bechtel. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing her name right. I got Shape with Rita Ora on the cover. And Time Magazine with the 100 Most Influential People uh, has John Legend on the cover. And he's being interviewed by Harry Belafonte. And then it has a bunch of celebrities being interviewed by other celebrities. Um, and one of the ones I really want to read is Ryan Reynolds being interviewed by Helen Mirren. Just sounds like it would be really entertaining. And then the last magazine that I got is Vogue with Katy Perry on it. Um, in my last video I showed like a nice hardcover journal that I had gotten from the 4 imprint company. Uh, and they let me pick two more samples because you can get three all together. So for my second sample I chose Organza bags and they sent me two of them. So they're just nice white bags, like little gift bags. Um, let me just kind of open. So I figure I can put either a gift for someone in it. Um, they have a little ribbon that's a drawstring. Or I can just use it for an eBay item and make two items look nice. Um, I was hoping to use it for part of my mom's uh, Mother's Day present, but I think the eBay seller canceled it because the ogre got all mixed up. I'll figure something out. <laughs> the other one is called an all-in-one mini notebook. So it's just a little spiral notebook that comes with a pen. And then it has um, a 5 inch little ruler. And then on this page, so I want to open it has page flags and sticky notes. So I believe it has 20 of each color and then 20 of the big ones. And then it has 50 sheets of regular lined paper. And then the other two are from my mom. She um, does like home clean out um, and like takes care of like does estate clean outs and stuff like that. Like 
sometimes after people have passed away or just storage unit clean out um and just antiques and flea markets and just kind of all kinds of stuff uh once in a while she gets to keep some of the things or just doesn't choose to sell them uh one of the things that she came across was this Martha Stewart pack of pillowcases that were brand new um so she gave them to me they're like a nice minty green color I have sort of minty green sheets they're actually a shade darker but I'm still going to use them so I thought that was nice to wear and then she gave me this book of rock lists from Rolling Stone it was kind of damaged so I taped the cover back on I have to try to tape it a little better it's from 1981, but it still sounds like it would be interesting. It's a pretty big book. Um, some of the things are like, uh, most boring bands, five bands with two or more drummers, the films of Elvis, great girl groups, best rock and roll movies, best hairdos, um, Jim Morrison's arrest record, uh, eight songs less than one minute, um, best punk names, famous pseudonyms, original all-time greatest hits. So I love books like this. And little lists and things. So it has like pictures. It's pretty neat, I think. I'll be interested in reading that one. That is everything that I got. Uh, that week. <laughs> actually last week I'm right getting this one up. So if you enjoyed um, this video, please give it a thumbs up. And thank you for watching. Bye.